Hi, quick little video on tan graphing tangent graphs, except this time we've got a little bit of a phase shift for us. So graphing tangent graphs, chapter 4.6. Recall tangent is sine over cosine. So we do have some naturally occurring asymptotes that we want to look for. The regular function is a tangent of bx minus c plus d. Again, the a is our amplitude, except in this point it'll be for a shoulder point, as you know, Tangent kind of goes like this and it runs to the middle, but then it also has these shoulder points where it goes up one side and then goes down the other, so like this or like this. Okay, so it's like a little, little dance move there. Tangent, crazy, crazy function. How do we find those asymptotes? Well, we set bx minus c equal to negative pi over 2 and at pi over 2. If you look at your unit circle, again, you recognize that there are naturally occurring asymptotes at negative pi over 2 and pi over 2. And so we graph the function that way. When we do our five key point method, uh, we want to make sure that we look at a left asymptote, a left shoulder point, a zero, a right shoulder point. These are going to, the shoulder points are going to determine how high the amplitude goes. And then the asymptotes again are covering those, a the areas there. So, our amplitude for this function is 2, and our period will be pi x plus pi over 4 is uh, what we need to look at to determine where those vertical asymptotes are occurring. So we set x plus 4 equal to negative pi over 2. We say x equals negative pi over 2 minus 4. We have uh, get a common multiple common denominator of 4, so I multiply top and bottom by 2, and we get x is equal to negative 3 pi over 4. The next one we have is x plus pi over 4 equals positive pi over 2. We subtract pi over 4 from both sides, we get x equals pi over 2 minus pi over 4, and if we subtract 45 degrees from 90, then we get x equal pi over 4. All right. So I've listed the two uh, asymptotes, the left side at negative 3 pi over 4 and the right side at pi over 4. So now we have to do is drop in those shoulder points left and right. We have a left shoulder point at negative pi over 2, and that's going to drop down here at a amplitude of 2. So we have that point. We have a 0 at negative pi over 4, and then we have a right shoulder point up here at y equal 2 at 0. So then we can just create the drawing and the graph will go through there and it will go through there like that. So that is the tangent curve with a phase shift. Hope you enjoy. Stop the video. Check it out every once in a while. Replay it. And make sure that those um, asymptotes you're finding uh, with negative pi over 2 and pi over 2. Thanks. Have a, talk to you soon.